our sparring drills for our beginners, our white belts. And the last one we're gonna work on, especially one of the most effective ones, is defensive side kick. So we talked about high block body punch defensively and offensively in a previous video, but this technique is really more defensive, hence the name defensive side kick or D side. So this is gonna be, you recognize someone's coming with a back fist or they're moving forward very aggressively, maybe with some punches. You're gonna create space and then you're just gonna use your front leg side kick to defend against it. So we're gonna use the big bag today. Uh, Mr. Neal's gonna have his kicking leg in front. All we're gonna do, just basically, so you can see if I move forward, he steps back, his back toes are facing away, his front knee comes up with his heel facing his opponent. So that way it's in between the target and him. He doesn't wanna point his knee, because now I can get in and I can clear this and he doesn't have a defensive really established. So it's very important, come right here, face that way. So it's very important when he picks this leg up, that his heel is facing there. So if you were coming in at him, you have to get through that foot to get to his body. Again, if his knee is facing it, it's not as intimidating because you can go around it, you can sometimes get through it, and the angle is gonna be a little off. So make sure you get that foot to face that target when you drive through. So a defensive side kick is gonna look like this. The, the pad holder is gonna have the pad, they're just gonna start walking, yeah. and then he's gonna back up and yeah. then kick, yep. Yeah. So all he's working on is trying to create space and then side kick. So again, notice I'm moving forward. If he doesn't move, if he doesn't move back, oh, I'm already there. So it's very important that as that forward motion starts happening, you counteract that forward motion with a backward step of your own and then get that knee up fast and then kick. As you get more advanced, we'll start talking about sliding kicks and uh, offensively using that side kick to get in quicker um, than not just defensively. But right now, this is just the beginner portion of that. So again, this is defensive side kick. The footwork, the step, the foot, where it's supposed to be in between you and your target is very important. So practice that down, get those basics down so that you can get it without thinking about it. That's the best way you know is when you just start doing it subconsciously, you don't have to think about the movement, then you know you've practiced it enough. Good luck with that. Train hard and remember, become better than you are today.